This is a pizzeria? This is the biggest pizzeria I've ever seen in my entire life. This looks more like the entrance to a shopping mall than a pizzeria. If you want a great way for your pizza company to go bankrupt, then this is it. There's one tree that's one block too short. This is killing my OCD. Also, there's no need for a vignette for a bright daytime scene. This defeats the purpose. Welcome, boys and girls, to our show. 24 FPS animations like this look incomplete without motion blur. Local brand new circuit. These metal robots have smooth bends. I could have turned the other cheek if they weren't shown with such attention to metal reflections. Baby Pizza World, we are- Ah, uh, yes. I remember that game from when I was a kid. The classic stare at a blank screen while you rock back and forth on a tiny bike ride. Looks like the company spent so much money on the giant mall-sized building that they couldn't afford to have anything shown on the video games. This kid has two layers of hair. The top layer is brown and smooth, but the bottom layer is black and speckly. Is this the new hairstyle all the kids are sporting these days? Pizza world, we are so thrilled. The kid on the far side of the ski balls is just dead inside. Also, what? This kid doesn't have a ski ball in his hand here, but when he throws it, it magically appears there. Is this Boris's cousin from Enchanted Mob's Build Our Machine? To have you here tonight. Come watch our animatronic. Enchanted Mob animation note. <clears throat> Circus Baby's skirt wasn't rendered in this whole first scene. It was later added through a separate render layer, and you can barely tell there was an anti-aliasing difference. Sin. Don't be shy, they don't bite. We are Adding five sins for all the After Effects depth of field faulty blurs. Our worst nightmares come out to play. Afton's eyebrow was just floating over his hair. <laughs> oh, I guess it's night now. Has Afton just been staring at Circus Baby for so long that it's already nighttime? That gives me some concerns. Also, this shot is a bit anticlimactic for the drop. Circus Baby just slides into the shot. Also, her fingers are disconnected from her arm. Foxy's arm flashes super bright white. Either a specular glitch or he's turning into a white void scene. You know the drill, guys. I thought I had And just like that, Funtime Freddy was instantly absorbed into Circus Baby's hips. Whatever happened to janitors? Afton is the co-owner. Fazbear Entertainment revenue must be low this month. Again, probably due to the mall-sized building. The wrists on these rigs need more loop cuts. I case snapping. Wait, he's taking out money from the cash registers too? Does he not have any employees for this stuff? Do you even have a and Circus Baby's head snapped off her neck and we never heard from her again. Do you even have one? Wait, so if Afton is walking towards the camera and Baby is holding still poses behind him, does that mean she's floating? Technically, yes. Actually, I animated this scene, as well as the whole video. This sin was brought to you by Enchanted Mob. Afton's fingers teleport into new positions after he puts his hat on. Ah! Upskirt! It's not subtle either. You can see more of her underskirt than above for the entire shot. Also, this walk cycle is so darn slow. This shot is pretty boring. No camera movements. All you see is Afton walking out for almost five straight seconds in a music video. Why does Afton have orange lights on him if in the last shot he was walking into a blue environment? Bye. Void scene, but with rain. The texture on Afton's mouth has a teeny tiny distortion. Maybe nitpicky, but sends us in. I'm just feeling like I'm falling down. Afton's nickname is Purple Guy, right? Why does his tie almost look blue here? All these monsters keep closing. Yes, I too sleep in the clothes that I wore throughout the day. Uh, no joke, I, I kind of actually do. It's not... Uh, let's move on. That pillow probably would have been more convincing without textures. And with an actual indent from the girl's head. Oh. Afton's hands get slightly overexposed right here at the end. Is she really here to have? What are the point of those fans? There's no side to suck air into and the fan is rotating at one spin per second. 
six feet under already. Stage light archway model does not arch. Also, the cubes on the archway model aren't evenly spaced out. This triggers my OCD so much that it warrants two sins. There's no doubt. White line on the top of Circus Baby's head wants to paper cut me. Seamless fade transition is not seamless. Huh? The hair on the girl is dynamic? Why go through the trouble of this girl when you ignored all the other characters' hair dynamics? Void scene part of the song surprisingly does not show a void scene on screen. Seriously, what is it with these FNAF videos and void scenes? Ditch this teddy bear model already. It's looking into my soul. This eyebrow offset animation is too much. It's distracting. Also, her bow clips right through her head. Bow implant? The girl's idol animation is not idle enough. She's boondoggling. Ah! So right after this part, did Circus Baby just awkwardly lean back and open her claw to snatch up the child? Seems much less climactic in my head. I'm not sure what these people are scared about. The fact that a girl was killed by an animatronic, or the fact that about 20 children were Thanos snapped out of the pizzeria. Gosh, we gotta cool it with the Thanos jokes. This. Circus Baby's elbow is stretched out so much, it looks like a sword. Times like this is when you need to say goodbye to the pixel perfect models, otherwise you'll end up with this. Wait, hold on. Is that Henry? Wait, what? The kid in the blue is back again, but this time instead of having extra hair, now he just has no hair at all. Jeez, this kid is going through some stuff. Can we all get an F in the chat? Now it's time to scream and shout. Or look at the camera with your mouth open. Same thing. These police siren lights have a mission, but they aren't actually illuminating anything around them. Nice to know that background building is on fire. The cop rigs have a separate mesh for the eyelids. Why? And ew. What happened to the bear? It looks like it came from the aftermath of the fire. Wrong FNAF game. That text is unreadable. When using extruded text, always make the extrusion a different shade so you can tell its dimensions. Otherwise, it's just a distorted, mushed mess. Also, Circus Baby is giving me Pinocchio vibes right now. Oh no, you almost made it through this whole video without another white void scene. Wait, is that a black void too? This is getting out of hand. In conclusion, this video was good. There's no doubt that this was a trendsetter for the Minecraft animation community. After this video was released, many inspired animators made their own recreations of this style of the video. Quality-wise, the animation was good. Some clipping issues could have been fixed, and the ending could have had some more interesting scenes and less filler, but it doesn't affect the video too much. Overall, a solid animation. Oh, if you can, we're looking everywhere beside you. Oh, it's her old friend. 
is her own brew. 